problem for us today is at a home that I think is going to blow you away because we are right now in the industrial modern team design home that was done up just about four years back and for people who love the patio with four bedrooms and free hole I think Mimosa Park is going to be something that you would love to have four bedroom three bath unit total size of 2153 square feet built in area totally modified to suit the best layout there is a lot of green space around parks 30 meters swimming pool kids pool fully equipped gym squash court there's a clubhouse with barbecue pit as well ping pong room sheltered and numbered car park lot possible for you to park additional cars for free 24 hour security and the maintenance fee is $407 per month couple of minutes drive to CT and SLE, 5 minutes drive to the Greenwich Mall. The Lita Mall is about 8 minutes away as well as all the delicious Jalan Kayu eateries. Selita Country Club not to mention and Aerospace is just 10 minutes drive away. This is your main door. Even the door itself is beautifully done with this nice timber door. So the moment you enter home, you will have this beautiful foyer with this timber strip divider that is on the right that overlooks towards your living room area. This portion was actually the stairway that leads down to the living room but it has been cleverly cuffed out into a very very deep storage space i don't even notice that there's this space the moment i enter and you just thought that this is like a full length mirror for you to have a look at yourself before you head out for work and on the left what you get is actually these five beautiful panels of full height shoe carpentry space and check this out sweet yeah the space has been very very carefully planned out this layout is very different you don't really feel like you're at a ground floor unit because right in front of you the distance and the setback to the border of the development is very far single load concept your own set of windows at the dining space that's overlooking towards the internal side of the development and then on this side there's actually no neighbors right here so you have full privacy See. Mimosa Park was actually completed in the 1979 period. Usually, a uh, property that is done in the 1970-1980 era, they will have this split concept is to accentuate the different base and different parts of the home, similarly to landed properties. The moment you enter, you can either turn left to your dining and your kitchen, or you come out right side to this beautiful space. You have this very, very lovely brick wall, customized and done up. The owners has also done up this hanging bookshelf here basically allows you to display all your beautiful stuff your books can really hold a lot of weight with the steel bars as well your dedicated living space is huge there's a three-seater there there's a two-seater here if you want to add on another two-seater right here to make a u-shape facing towards the tv console that's perfect as well and this is towards the south orientation so you have huge windows bottom shelving for storage you can fit in a lot of stuff like all the dvds and the books and, and stuff that you have windows has all been changed and revamped you have this full length window here as well that's overlooking towards your patio so this is the view that you get south facing i just open up the door just slide on the two windows and this is the breeze that i get constantly right here at mimosa park area you're actually in the landed enclave of the salita area everywhere north south east west around you they are all landed properties which means that the airflow is fantastic there's no high rise that's blocking the wind flow and stuff like that as you come by the whole entire dining space has been flushed with this beautiful cement squid wall floorings um, is actually industrial style homogeneous tiles the state of maintenance is fantastic Fantastic. Uh, all the electrical wirings and plugs has all been changed. This is now a, a eight seater. Ten seater is definitely not a problem. Here you have space for your bookshelves and all these are nice collectible antique furnitures that our owners love to have. Your master room is actually here. Why don't we have a look at the master room first? Let's go. This is the first bedroom, the largest bedroom. King bed is right here. I love all these kind of windows whereby you have a lot of bottom shelvings. It's really add on to the storage space. Zero afternoon sun because it's direct sun south facing and the back of the home is north facing after you put in your king bed you still have this huge space and your kids can still put in their play mat here and play their lego and stuff while mommy and daddy just uh, play the organ and watch tv and stuff like that and of course on suite honeycomb style kind of floor finishes beautiful white wall tiles with the black team frosted glass door quality is fantastic as well and state of condition is really awesome 
your own rain shower, great ventilation in the master bathroom as well. This second bedroom is currently converted into a study area plus the walk-in wardrobe so you can also easily convert it back to your own singular bedroom as well. But right now what the owner has done is that they have opened up this door and crafted a sliding panel here so that it feels like part of the master bedroom as well. They have created space for three tables for their kids and also for themselves to work from here and study from here as well. Bookshelf space and the single look concept is fantastic because at the back of your home you do not get to see any other units is actually facing towards the internal part of the development your gigantic walk-in wardrobe space a lot a lot of different kinds of shelving space you have like a mixture of closed cabinets for your hanging racks This common bathroom is done with like a sunken bath kind of concept so you can actually just feel out the water here have kids play here before they finish the bath and you have to check out this this is 60 kilograms it is carved out custom made from a granite rock it's really solid so if you own this place, this is a bonus for you. It's gonna last you many, many different generations. There's a steel finish, bottom, vanity, worktop, huge wall space for your mirrors as well with a separate rain shower. All right, let's head to the third room. Very big space, enough for king or queen bed. Right now we have a single bed with this nice bun door wardrobe. Check out the rollers. Check out the rollers. You have a study table, bookshelves here. Let's do a brightness check. It's close to 6 p.m. now. The room is bright. There's no afternoon sun. It's quiet here, so really good place for your kids to study for their PSLE. All right, fourth bedroom. All the rooms and living area has an awesome amount of nicely planned track lights and ceiling fan. Blinds has already been done. The room space is fantastic as well to put bookshelves and wardrobe and bed and stuff like that and a lot of toys. As you're approaching towards the kitchen, you'll find that the kitchen and the dining space have this like L-shaped kind of window here that really provides an awesome amount of ventilation. This is the third bathroom. It's been nicely done also for your guests. You also have a helper's room, custom built storage space, bookshelves, those hanging rack, nice ventilation window. Uh, if you don't have a live-in helper, this can then be your additional second storeroom as well. As you come into your kitchen, you have an extra back door leading straight to the car park. As you park your car, you can just come back straight after your supermarket grocery shopping. Just bring all your stuff right here. S-shaped kitchen cabinet style, Spanish style kind of floor tiles. This part overlooks towards uh, your car park space. So when you're cooking your wife comes home your hubby comes home your kids come home you know that they're home because this is the part that they actually enter back from the front gate there's a lot of countertop space so if your home has a lot of chef because big units usually you have more people staying so if your parents stay with you or your siblings stay with you there's a lot of space for preparation over here for baking if you want to prep your food and you want to wash it here's for cooking plus oven has already been done and this is the compact plus model finishing it's very lasting it's the modern kind of material that a lot of people are using when they renovate their place and you have big fridge space as well the top carpentry and the bottom carpentry there's a lot of storage available and we really love the door I want you to have a look at this view so as you walk to the end of the living room and then you have this additional door and then you feel like gosh my home is huge I have a lot of space I have a nice fencing nice plants I have nice trees and that's where you park all your bikes kids can just play here just scoot here as well and then you have like a mini mini side door there's a nice walk path surrounding the whole Mimosa Park condominium it's really lovely and the state of maintenance is fantastic this is very very suitable for people who wants to stay in like a landed field kind of concept but yet do not want the staircase I think this is going to be awesome and fantastic my name is Melvin Lim Prop Lim Brothers as you know we are always happy to show the place.